pituitary tumor is a benign growth that grows from within the pituitary gland in the body. The pituitary gland is one of the main hormonal control centers in the body that helps to regulate the hormonal production and functions of the rest of the body. Pituitary tumors evolve when a cell within the pituitary gland becomes unregulated in its growth. This happens when the genetic control mechanisms of the cell are dysfunctional and the cell begins to grow in an unregulated fashion. Pituitary tumors can cause a wide range of symptoms. The symptoms can be divided into two main categories. One category of symptoms that can be caused by pituitary tumors is from the mass effect of the tumor itself. As the tumor grows, it begins to press on areas in the brain surrounding the pituitary gland and can cause dysfunction of the pituitary gland itself and cause injury to the nerves and parts of the brain that surround the gland. Most commonly, these symptoms include difficulty with vision, whether that be a loss of vision from pressure on the eye nerves or optic nerves that run directly above the gland, or whether that be issues with the cranial nerves that control the movement of the eyes that can cause double vision and other sorts of issues. Second category involve symptoms that come from dysfunction of the hormones in the gland and in the rest of the body. The tumors as they grow can cause the pituitary gland to under secrete the hormones that are needed in the rest of the body which can cause a wide range of symptoms related to the specific hormones that are dysfunctional. The other situation that can arise is when a pituitary tumor produces too much of a particular hormone. In this case, we call this a secreting tumor. There are three more common types of hormones that are overproduced by these tumors. That includes overproduction of prolactin and what we call a prolactinoma. The hormone excess of prolactin can cause enlargement of the breast tissue and lactation or milk production. A second sort of secreting tumor that can arise within the pituitary gland is called a Cushing's tumor. This tumor overproduces a hormone called ACTH. And this hormone controls the levels of cortisol in the body. This excess of steroid or cortisol in the body can lead to a number of very significant problems, including heart dysfunction, high blood pressure, diabetes, and obesity. The final over-secreting tumor that can arise within the pituitary gland is called a growth hormone secreting tumor. The results of that growth hormone secretion cause overgrowth of the distal hands and fingers, as well as growth of the frontal bone and nose and other soft tissue structures in the body. For pituitary tumors, there are a couple treatment options. They revolve very much so on what effects the tumor is having on the body. In some cases of very, very small tumors being less than a centimeter in size, which do not secrete hormones and do not cause dysfunction of the pituitary gland itself, and do not cause any visual symptoms. These tumors can often be carefully observed without any direct intervention. In tumors that don't fit into that group, whether they grow to a point of causing visual disturbances or whether they are producing hormones and causing effects from hormonal overproduction, in those cases, the tumors need to be treated. The best treatment option for them and the frontline treatment option is a surgical treatment where we go in to remove the tumor from around the gland.